sorry, my friend. Children of nowadays, especially the girls, know nothing but follow older men than their age for money. They sleep around and mess themselves up, get pregnant, and bring shame to their family. In fact, I need to thank God for giving me a son instead of a daughter. Can you imagine? After all my sufferings and bimbo, she chose to disgrace herself, not me. Where is she, by the way? She said she was going for an interview. Interview? With pregnancy? She has some girls to be carrying herself around with pride after what she did. I have told her she has until this weekend to pack her things and leave my house. I am cutting every tide with her. I'd rather be childless than have a disgrace as a daughter. You are even too lenient giving her until weekend to leave. I trust myself she will be on the streets already. Good afternoon, Yami. Come back here. Didn't you see my friend? Can't you greet? Or you lost your sights and manners along with your marbles. Your friend? The one advising you to kick your only child out. Sorry, Yami. That woman sitting there is no friend of yours. She hates you very much and you have taught me to avoid strangers. I don't know her. That makes her a stranger. I don't talk to strangers. Excuse me. Bimbo! Bimbo! Yeah, Bimbo, can you see that? Look at the way your useless daughter disrespected me just now. It's not her fault. I am going to my house. Please, in your diary, I will make sure I deal with her. Please, don't be upset. How come you raised such a rebellious and shameless daughter? Can't you see she isn't even remorseful? You should throw her out already. Since when did you become this soft, yabbing boy? If you can't deal with her, hand her over to me. I will do the needful. What rubbish. You cannot become my boss under my own roof. You embarrass me in front of my friend. I see you have grown wings since you have started sleeping with men. You are old enough to take care of yourself. After all, I was about your age when I had you. Yami, you are throwing me out at this time of the night because your friend said you should. What kind of friend advises you to throw out your only child? Yes, I made a mistake, but it wasn't intentional. It was a mistake and I planned on making amends. Pregnancy is not a disease. That I'm pregnant doesn't mean I'm useless. I don't have a job or a house yet. At least let me stay until I can sort myself out and I will leave. Over my dead body, you will not spend another night in my house. Go to your baby daddy or go to your father's house. I don't care. But you will no longer go and sit under the same roof. I don't want to come back here and still meet you. Yummy. If you don't want me to lay a curse on you, don't let me come back to this sitting room and meet you. Who is that knocking my door so violently at this time of the night? Hey, 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 madam, where do you think you are going to with all those bags? I am sure you're not blind. I've come to stay with you. Why else will I have all my bags with me? You must be joking. Just like that. Didn't you say you didn't want to have anything to do with me anymore? Wasn't that why you made sure you impregnated me? Impregnated you? Shade the wine mini. You are pregnant for me? You must be excited. Of course. I told you I was going to marry you. After all your shakara, you are here by your own will. Where would I sleep? Forgive my manners, my lady. Going somewhere? You know you will have to talk to me at some point if we are going to be staying under the same roof. No, I don't want to talk to you. I already told you, I will leave your house once I'm able to get a job. So pretend I don't exist and I'll also pretend you don't exist. Really? Fine. Do you still have money to take you around? You can take the money I left for you in the drawer, you know? Being stubborn doesn't suit you. I don't need your money. She is so stubborn. Let me see if she will be able to keep up with this stubbornness by the time she is due to give birth. Welcome back. Bimbo, please let's talk. What else do you want to talk about, Randy? I have been jump hurting. I am tired. Please come and sit down. This is important. Make it quick. We must go see your mom. 
Why? Because it's the right thing to do. Stop trying to get ahead of yourself, Randy. I don't plan on getting serious with you. I am only pregnant for you. Be satisfied that I am keeping it. Stop dreaming. Okay, I know what to do. We shall see. Never meant to hurt me. Good afternoon, ma. Good afternoon, no. Please, who am I speaking with? I am Randy, ma. Bimbo's fiance. Bimbo's fiance? So you are the irresponsible boy that impregnated my daughter? I am sorry, ma. I am calling in respect to that. I don't have any business with you over the phone. If you want to talk to me, you know where to find me. Do the right thing. You don't mean it. He called you. Who did he say he wants? Is he even supposed to be calling you? Trust me, I told him to do the right thing. He knows where to find me if he wanted to talk to me. Very good. These children of nowadays are something else. He was calling you instead of him to prostrate flat at your feet asking for forgiveness. I am still waiting for them to come. It automatically means you have a wedding to plan. Wedding? Our church does pregnancy tests on the bride before they agree to join them in holy matrimony. They still do that at this time and age? Now wow! I can't go through that humiliation. The gossip will never end. At least he should pay her bride price. Charge him well for the dowry. You have suffered to single-handedly raise her. You should eat the fruit of your labor. Abio, I should not do two to zero. At all, it's not allowed. Thank you, Oremi. Anyhow the matter goes, I will let you know. Okay, keep me posted. I will check on you before the week runs out. Okay, I will see you then. Bye. Never meant to hurt me, no. Babe, Afana. Omo, long time no see, Jerry. What up? Are you married now? Wow, congrats there. When last did you hear from your friend? Bimbo now? Yes, so oh, my uni crush. I've been trying to locate her to no avail. Perhaps, do you still have her house address? I know you guys used to be best of friends. Oh, I'll be glad. Thanks so much, eh? Thank you. My regards to your husband. Alright, bye. I am way wiser than you, Bimbo. If you want it the hard way, then you get it the hard way. Huh. Sorry, yo, Remy. I haven't been able to go to the market since this pregnancy issue. All my body has been shaking. You better take it easy. Those that did not give birth are living their lives. Don't let any child give you hypertension and kill you. What has happened has happened. The only thing to think about now is the way forward. Who is that? Come inside though. The door is not locked. Young man, who are you? I am Randy Ma. I am Bimbo's fiance. I have come to seek for forgiveness. I and Bimbo have not done anything to be proud of. We are sincerely sorry. Please forgive us. Such a good boy. Look how remorseful he is, unlike Bimbo's show of arrogance. Get up and sit down. Where is Bimbo? She didn't come along with you, right? I tried to make her come, but all my pleas fell on deaf ears. What is wrong with that girl? Do you love her? Do you want to marry her? If you give us your blessings, ma. You have my blessings. Please take care of her. Thank you, ma. Here is a little token. It should cover the dowry and bride price. We will conclude the ceremony after she puts to bed. Don't worry. Use it to take care of her. When you are ready to bring your people, you can bring it along. What did you say? Please drop it and leave. <laughs> What are you trying to do? Trying to get close to my wife, of course. Your wife? Who is your wife? Are you dizzy? When did you pay my bread price? Your mom didn't tell you. Tell you what? And how did you know my mom? I went to see her to formalize everything. You are kidding, right? Do I look like I am kidding? You went to my mother without my consent. How many more rules are you planning to break? You slept with me without my consent. You impregnated me without my consent. Now you went to see my mom without my consent. You think I will let you live to be with another man when you are pregnant with my child? Are you insane? You are mine now. So watch how you talk to me. I will no longer condone your nonsense. Oh, the one I'm in love with.